Hey guys, I've been using the internet for a terrifyingly long time now, since BBS days, which kind of came before the internet. And one thing that I've noticed with different platforms and different mediums is that uh, the ones where it's sort of moderated and uh, there's an operator and uh, you know they can choose to ban people, those ones kind of suck. Uh, that's one thing that really put me off IRC when I first started using it and sort of like hash Durban and ZANet, which is literally just crazy long time ago now, was that you know some some of the Illuminati, some of the cabal had the the sort of operator status. And if anyone sort of like insulted them or they just didn't get along with, they would just, you know, kick ban them and um, that would be that. What I choose to do on IRC, um, if I don't like the person, I just slash ignore that person. Ignoring is so much better way of dealing with, a, with someone you just don't, you know, want to hear from. Like, banning them is really the wrong approach in my opinion. Um, so same goes for email lists. If I if I if I don't like what someone is saying, I just choose to ignore or just delete the uh, the email. I mean, obviously that email is still archived on the main list, and everyone else gets it, and they can choose to read it or not. I, I, I you know I make my own decision. I like to make my own decision. I do not like to enforce and be fascist about it, and let some uh, and and basically uh, censor someone from speaking. So uh, the reason why I mention all this is because here we are. Um, I'm, I, I dared to post on the Arch Linux forums. I'm not, not a fan of web forums, not a fan at all. And, uh, well, what's the problem here? The problem here is that I, I, um, I basically got up, um, well, let's see here. Uh... I mean, the content's not important. I mean, I, I, I think I'm being accused of being a ranty. I mean, to be honest, I wanted to have a debate about UFI, and my experience of it was not very good. Um, but unfortunately, I, I, um, you know, first off, the the operator here, the forum moderator Trilby says, you know, I lucked out today because I was in a good mood this morning, and um, my my uh, my post wasn't binned i.e. deleted from the forum and that means that basically no one gets to see it just gets deleted instead what they did was put it in the uh this this is going nowhere forum and you know i don't mind that if someone wants to wrench it out from installation and they think oh well oh well this is just i don't know not appropriate for installation this is some sort of wider debate blah 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 i mean that's all very well, but the the thing that really annoys me is if you um, you know open up, if you if you try to link this, it doesn't work. See bad request. The link you followed is incorrect or outdated. They basically not only uh, put it into another forum where people don't see it, they've made it sort of unlinkable. Right. So basically. This is just as just as good as if it was deleted. Really, I mean, this is this is w way over the top. This is this is like kick banning, in my opinion. So you, there's no way you can see my 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 discussion on for me to link to discussion as I try to do on Twitter. So anyone following that link just won't won't see the discussion, won't see how it was moderated. You know, if someone chooses to read this, they cannot. So. This has gone way, way too far, way over slash ignoring. It's more on the sort of kick ban thing. And, you know, I think that we had a, a fairly good discussion in the end. But unfortunately, the, um, the power, all powerful uh, moderators didn't think so. And, and sadly, power corrupts. And please do not forget that.